So here we are for the final round at Irwindale Speedway. What actually may be the final fight of Irwindale period as it's closing down. While it's definitely sad to think about this place going away, change is not always a bad thing. It's been pretty awesome driving alongside my Nitto Tire teammates this year. I mean, everybody is very unique and, and brings their own style and personality to the track. You know, Odie is just a mad scientist when it comes to car setup. He doesn't have the most horsepower, he doesn't have the biggest budget, but arguably makes his car work the best at every track. And you know, he's such a cool and calm, collected guy and you know, soft-spoken out of the car, but when he puts that helmet on, he just becomes an animal and his passion and his, his desire to be competitive out here is uh, something that's just awesome to see. Mad Mike coming in from New Zealand. The dude is an animal behind the wheel, wild personality on and off the track. And I mean, when he's on it, you just hear that rotary screaming. He's never lifting off the throttle. He's got a little bullet and uh, really pumped to just see him progress so much this year from his first effort in Formula Drift a few years ago. Super proud of that dude and all his hard work is, is paying off, which is uh, something I respect a lot. You know, Tanner is arguably one of the best diverse drivers in the world, whether he's doing rally or road racing or drifting or short course trucks. I mean, the dude gets behind a wheel and drives. And that's something for me, Tanner really inspires me with is, you know, he's not a one trick pony. He just proves it that he's a driver and, uh, you know, definitely happy to call him a friend and a teammate. <laughs> I'm definitely a bit bummed to be sitting on the sidelines and, and not competing for the first time in 12 years here at the, the final round of Formula Drift. But uh, all in all, you know, it's been a, a pretty good year. Definitely a year of learning, a year of mistakes, and one of those years that, that will, without a doubt, after a, a, an off season and a reset, it's gonna make me stronger, make my team stronger. And I'm just super pumped to come back in 2016, bigger, better, and better.